okay so to solve this problem i'm gonna write this as 2 raised to power 3 so i have that this is 2 is equal to 2 raised to power 3 and the thing the 3 is actually gonna multiply the square root of x okay so of course you know that these two are can also is can also be written as 2 raised to power 1 and since the powers are the same i can go ahead to cancel the powers and i'll have that 1 is equal to 3 uh, root x right there okay so i can go ahead to divide both sides by 3 right here and if i do that i'll have 1 over 3 is equal to root x okay and okay, so then at this point so you can clearly see that here that 1 over 3 is equal to so i can actually write this as x raised to power 1 over 2 right here so what i want to do for me to actually take care of this so i'm going to take the square of both sides okay so this is 1 over 3 and i will take the square okay 1 over 3 squared and it is equal to x raised to power 1 over 2 and i will also square it so this these two we actually uh, cancel this half right here and then i am left with 1 over 9 over here okay and it is equal to x and of course this is actually going to be our final answer that x is equal to 1 over 9 we can actually go ahead to run a very uh, quick check to see whether our answer is correct and so to do that let us do that right here so we have that this is 2 uh, 2 is equal to 8 raised to power 1 over 9 over here so i'm going to take the square root of all of this so i can have that this is a 2 is equal to the square root of 1 is actually 1 and then the square root of 9 is 3 okay so i can go ahead to write this 8 as 2 raised to power 3 and then multiply by 1 over 3 3 can cancel 3 here then i'm left with 1 so you see that 2 equal to 2 raised to power 1 which basically 2 is equal to 2 and of course you can see that the answer satisfies the equation so thank you so much ensure you give this video a thumb up subscribe to our channel and i'm going to see you guys in my next video bye